The only place we tell them it's okay to get those like emotional needs met is in a romantic relationship. Yeah, so a lot of them don't get this. Yeah. Or like in a very like superficial, yeah. like bro yep. type of... For definitely. The loneliness is very high for men. I think it's a time issue. And I think most of your kids' friends' parents end up being your friends. Because we've given a lot of lip service in our culture to, we've almost treated friendship like it's a women's issue, right. and we haven't treated it like it's a human need. It seems like men foster, or, or they aim to foster more, um, I don't want to say superficial, but it, they bond quicker on, on things that are more circumstantial or environmental. Whereas women tend to want something deeper. Is that, is that complete BS? So I will take a stance on this that is not completely accepted. Mm -hmm. uh, like not all of the experts would agree on this. Some mm -hmm. people do believe that men do friendship differently than women. Mm -hmm. I, I see that it's happening differently, but I don't believe that's because that's how it's supposed to be. We look at mm -hmm. other cultures and men and some cultures are the ones who actually go hang out more and share more. Like mm -hmm. you go to Greece and there's men hanging out in cafes and talking about right. their lives and you go to other countries. So I think we've conditioned men and women to do friendships differently. Differently. Mm -hmm. Boys and girls all the way up to around 10 or 11 talk about friendship the same whether they're boy or girl and then right. something happens when they start yeah. feeling like you can't be like a girl and it kind of starts separating yeah. out and then the boys have to start joking around and hitting each other more yeah. and then, then we see the suicide rate as climb with the boys. I mean and so there's a lot of factors there that would say this is a human need for us to feel close to people. There was a really interesting podcast um, on NPR called the the Lonely American Man, mm -hmm. where they talk exactly about this situation, this particular phenomenon where boys in middle school, up to that point, they're like, yeah, he's my best friend, we love sleepovers, and then suddenly they switch over from going into, yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, it's not a romance, um, it, it's like a bromance, and it does have something to do with um, with homophobia yeah. in some yeah. sense because men don't want to be they don't want to be considered gay and, and they don't want to be considered effeminate. Yeah, and sexism. I mean, nobody wants yeah. to be like a girl either. And I, I think know, and you can yeah. we can actually trace back and there's some great sociologists who are actually looking at why so many of us girls want to be friends with boys and act like boys yeah. because that's a much more revered. Um, yeah status than it was yeah. to be a girl, and we didn't want to be like like all the other girls because yeah. it was negative. And Across the board, we're seeing um, how we've not allowed or encouraged or modeled or right. given permission for men to practice vulnerability outside of a romantic relationship. And so I think that's why we see their loneliness skyrocketing because they really don't have the practice that we yeah. women have had. Like we got our whole teenage years practicing being vulnerable yeah. and at age 11, 12, like boys had to stop doing that. And you know, when it comes to dating, if you have a great date, you get dropped off, and you're, you're just like you're looking for the next time. Yeah, you're like yeah, it's, yeah. you're not going to be like that was so much fun. We should do it again yeah. at the end of the summer, and like wait a few months. You know, we would yeah. be like, what? We make time to get to know each other, and yet in our friendships, we'll be like, see you someday, or yeah. like that was great. Yeah. And Let's we'll, get together. Yeah, and three yeah. months later, yeah. and so when then we wonder why we don't feel connected because we like lost all momentum. Yeah. We have no consistency, and like the more infrequently we see each other, the more our time is filled with like updating because we don't have to, we That's can't go such deeper. A good point. Yeah, you have to just kind of, you, you kind of have to catch up. On totally, and you can't like talk about all the other things that are really yeah. sharing and stuff. Yeah. So that consistency piece is at, like so required. <laughs>